Thank you. All right, so first fish of the day. A little whiting. All right, so this is the sand whiting that we just caught previously today. Now I'm gonna show you how to fill this it and then cook it. So first we're just gonna make a cut straight down up near his gills. Then we're gonna come back under here and then follow his back bones all the way down to his tail and this has already been gutted and f scaled so there's one fillet now for the other one so we're gonna make another cut around and then follow it right down across here right down here all right so for this um, cornflake crumbing, we're going to have an egg and we want a little bit of milk here and you just beat this together. Some flour. Alright, so the third ingredient that we'll need is some cornflake crumbs for the fish. That will be enough. Alright, so we've got these little sand whiting fillets and now we're going to um, crumb them. So we go the flour first. Then we chuck it straight into the egg. Around there. We go into the cornflake crumbs. Make sure you get it all on the little whiting. Alright, that's one done. And then with the other one, you do the same. And there we go. Alrighty, so we've let this sit in the fridge for all afternoon. And... To test if this is ready, you just grab some of your crumbs and just put it in and see how it's sizzling like that. That's perfect. So you just put these straight in here on top. And we usually let these sit for about five to six minutes. Over there, you just flip her over and then do the other side for about another three minutes. All right, so we've just cooked up this fish and we took it off. So now we're going to eat it. Are we going to eat it or not? That is really nice. It actually is really good. Mm. The cornflake crumbs makes it ten times better. Alright guys, so make sure you like and subscribe. Cheers!